y'all happy tuesday i wanted to kind of pick up my camera and just vlog for you guys because i know right now it's just a really weird time and everyone's social distancing so i thought i would do my part make some content for you guys keep you guys entertained on youtube while you guys are just not out and about in the world so i thought i would do a day in the life of social distancing and just like some self-care stuff too pausing the video to tell you guys that today's sponsor is rooted rituals because i have a lot of things i want to do today um that pertain to self-care i live here in austin texas with my boyfriend ryan and i also have a dog so i'm very lucky to have someone during this really lonely time because i am an extrovert i've been cooking more which is nice um but i'm also worried that i'm gonna run out of food even though we bought a frick ton of it it is currently 7 30 a.m and that's when i start my job if you guys don't know I am a content creator for a student housing company and they're actually located in Athens, Georgia. So they start work at nine. Um, so technically I would start work at eight, but I asked if I could start work at 7.30 so I could get done at 3.30. And also I only work 30 hours per week, so I get Fridays off, which is really nice. I'm gonna go ahead and get to work, but I'm really excited to share with you guys some of my favorite products, including the Rooted Rituals hair care. I'm not sure if I already said this, but I do work from home normally, so it's nothing really different. And I know it's really bad that I'm sitting on my couch. I sometimes work from my desk, but I don't know. I'm just like in the mood to just sit on my couch and work in a comfy spot. And I'm just hanging out with Sophie. She's like whining in my ear. I need to take her out soon. Um, but I am currently working on some video content. I think they want to do some like ads on somewhere i'm not really sure where they're gonna put them it's currently 9 51 a.m and i finally got the okay for all my videos that i made well i haven't made them all but there's four i have to make and i got the okay for two but ryan is working from home with me he started working from home last friday was it yeah how do you like it kind of sucks i don't like it that much really yeah the office is like way more just like convenient it's just kind of funny because you're an introvert and i feel like you would like it better yeah. I sit in that room all day and then they like track everything I do all the time. They, they track it? Well, yeah, I just send like activity logs and stuff. Oh, they, for real? I just don't trust me. I just clocked out for my lunch break, so we're gonna start doing some self care right now. Like I said, this video is sponsored by Rooted Rituals. Their hair care line is full of scalp care. I thought these products were so cool when I heard about it because I have a really dry scalp and sometimes it gets a lot worse. I've dealt with eczema my whole life. I've had like really, really bad dandruff. So I was really excited to try these out just because I'm always looking to be better in my health and my skincare and my scalp care now. I've been using the conditioner, the shampoo, and the scalp scrub and this is a product I highly recommend. I really also like their shampoo because it lathers so well. The best thing about these products is that the smell is not too extreme. This one smells a little bit more floral. It's a ginger root and mint. So it does have that mint in it, but it's not too extreme, which I like. Um, but right now I'm actually gonna be using the cooling and strengthening tonic. This is gonna sound so gross to some of you guys, but I try not to wash my hair if I really don't have to. So the last time I washed my hair was on Friday and it is currently Tuesday, which that's kind of like a long time to go without washing my hair, but now it is definitely getting greasy um and my scalp is not feeling too great it was definitely getting a little bit itchy yesterday um and i was just like eh, i'll shower tomorrow but now i'm feeling real itchy by the way their products are safe for color treated hair so i just got my hair dyed like what was it like a month or two ago so this product has like a little dropper tool and i'm just gonna separate my hair and add a couple of drops where i feel like it's needed this product really isn't oily either. I was expecting it to be more of like an oil, so it would like moisturize your scalp, um, but it isn't super oily, so that's that's nice. And with my scalp, like it's not just itchy all over. There are definitely like some random like little spots that it gets more dry than other. So I definitely like the precision of this eyedropper tool. I'm just massaging the product in with this cute little tool that is also from Rooted Rituals. Just really want to get deep into that scalp and press that product in. 
This ginger root and vitamin E tonic not only helps to revitalize the scalp, but also it helps with breakage and just helps to thicken existing strands. You can get these products at Walmart, which is really great because you already know they're going to be really affordable. Um, and I'm going to be using this scrub later tonight with their shampoo and conditioner. So if you guys have any issues with your scalps, dryness, or anything like that, breakage, definitely check these products out. I will have a link down below or you can find them at Walmart. So like I said, my lunch break is 30 minutes, which isn't too long, but I wouldn't want an hour because then it like takes away from the time that you could be working and then you just like have to work later if that makes sense so I'm kind of glad that it's 30 minutes but I just did the dishes I put the dishwasher on and now I'm just gonna clean up in the living room because last night I made pasta and usually I put the dishes away I literally like clean everything make sure everything's back in the refrigerator but for some reason I think Ryan took the dishes to the sink last night so I didn't even think about putting away like cheese and stuff I mean I think it's fine but I totally forgot so I'm gonna clean up the whole apartment and honestly I feel like this is self-care for me because I love having a clean apartment and then lighting a candle afterwards like that is like the best feeling So I just cleaned up and I actually threw our sheets in the wash because I don't remember the last time I did that, so oops. But Ryan is coming home with some Chipotle, so I'm gonna eat that and get back to work. Right now it's just such a weird time to be in, but all we can do is think about the positives. I've seen so many like little infographics saying that like, oh, right now is the perfect time to like research into a new business or something like that, or just take the time to like do you. So I thought that was really cool. Chipotle? Fell over Wait, what? Oh no. <laughs> uh, uh oh. It is after 3.30 and I'm finally off work. I just clocked out. So obviously, as you guys know, I do YouTube. So the work doesn't stop after my corporate job. I do YouTube. I create Instagram content. Sometimes working on my own brand does feel like self-care to me because I'm like investing in myself and I know that is work and like some people won't classify that as self-care but sometimes I just feel so like at peace doing my thing and having time for my work if that makes sense especially because I just started this new corporate job after working for myself for so long. And also I am a photographer and videographer. I do that freelance so like like I said, it's just nice having time for my own things and my own brand. So I do personally classify it as self-care and it's just fun. It's fun working on your own brand and yourself. Also, these nails are heinous and we need to do something about them. Before I hop in the shower, I just want to give a quick overview of all the products I'm going to be using in the shower. So like I said before, I really, really love this scalp scrub, the quick rinse scalp scrub. I've also been using this shampoo and conditioner. I'm literally so excited to shower because I haven't washed my hair in so long, so this is much needed. But after that tonic, my head literally stopped itching. So I highly, highly recommend this tonic if you guys do go days without washing your hair or you just have like a really dry scalp. And honestly, like my hair doesn't really look that oily. Like granted it is in a bun, but I feel like it would have looked way worse because I thought it was gonna be an oil, but it isn't, so that's great. Another thing that I love to do when I'm feeling like stressed or just need like a little bit of like me time i heat up the shower and then i put like a few drops of this eucalyptus oil um it's like an essential oil you can literally get any kind it definitely gives you spa vibes I just got out of the shower. My head feels so clean. Thank you so much to Rooted Rituals for sponsoring this video. Now we can get into some skincare. I've been loving this cleansing water. I use this to not only calm my skin, but to take off any extra makeup or dirt that's on my skin. I didn't wear makeup today, but there's still some gross stuff on here. And even if you don't wear makeup during the day, it doesn't mean you shouldn't wash your face or like cleanse it at night. Whenever I forget to wash my face, even if I don't have makeup on, I feel like I get some kind of acne after. Um, but this is another thing I've been using. It is the gel cream. It's like a thin layer, but it doesn't make me feel like rubbery after. I'm gonna go get changed and then figure out what I'm doing next. It got so dark in our apartment just now because the rain is <laughs> moving in. Ryan thinks I'm like talking to some ghost. I'm talking to you. I feel like this is 
good because when it rains it's like nice to put on a candle oh my god i didn't even put on my candle after i cleaned so now i can do that but um i'm actually gonna try i'm gonna attempt to take off my dip nail um i looked up some youtube tutorials which it's this pretty much the same as like taking off gel but you have to like file your nails down a little bit first to get off the shiny coat so i'm gonna try that hey y'all it is the next day i wanted to close the vlog off because i guess i forgot to vlog after i took off my dip this is what my nails look like now and i will be looking forward to the day that i can get my nails done i hope you guys aren't going completely insane literally today i was like getting so delusional that i was like laughing at a tiktok and i started like crying i don't know what's happening but um i hope you guys are all staying safe and super healthy and i just wanted to give my best wishes to everyone i know this is a really weird time and i've said that like a hundred times in this vlog but if you guys do want to see more content from me especially now that maybe some of you don't have school or you're online or just have more free time um definitely let me know of any video ideas you guys want to see that i can film in my house <laughs> um or just any other content i hope you guys are doing everything you guys can to maximize this time doing self-care working on yourself, working on your brand. Comment down below one of your favorite self-care things and we can just start like a list in the comments. So I will see y'all in my next vlog. Bye.